So this is what's happening on uh, Dave's garage or Dave's man cave, whatever the hell my channel is. Um, Nico's buying my bike today. So that is going to a new home. The proceeds of that sale will pay that one off in full. And then, um, you know, just gets rid of some debt. It's gonna, more importantly, um, now that I've got that thing, um, I'm spending a lot more time in that. And I just don't have the time to drive that and play in the mountains and do all my stuff and then give both bikes the kind of attention they need. And, you know, they're both new. It's a 2022. Um, you know, it was like an $18,000 bike and that one was 15. And, you know, I put money into both of them. Um, they're both new bikes, you know, and I just, it's a lot of expense sitting there, not getting a whole lot of use. If I have one, then it makes sense because I'm going to drive the shit out of it. But trying to go between two bikes and the car, it's just not enough time in the day to give the two bikes uh, their due. So why have that expense for two bikes that are used, you know, half as much as they should. So what we're going to do is Nico's buying that. And then um, I'm just going to have that one for a while. Now, I'm sure at some point I'll trade it in on a Ducati Street Fighter or, I don't know, something that'll catch my eye probably next year. But um, for the meantime, that's what I'm going to be riding. And then we're going to get a dumpster in here. And this shit is getting cleaned out. So I'm going to see if I can rope in Jim and Nico and Nick and Cameron and uh, any of the people that I've helped with Dave's Garage and doing work and suspension on their bikes and <laughs> tuna, you know, uh, oil changes and all that. I'm going to say, Hey, let's have a Saturday here and we'll get some pizzas and beers and hang out at the pool afterwards. And I'm going to get a, a dumpster from trash pandas, um, and have them drop it right here in the, in the driveway. And I am cleaning this garage the hell out. Anything that does not absolutely have a use and need to be here right in the dumpster. So that some of those shelves are coming out. Whatever's left on the one shelf is going to be absolute essentials. That whole work area is going to get cleaned up. Um, I've got the lift over there. That mat is coming out, and there's going to be a tire machine over there with a balancer. Both bikes are going to be on that side. And with all this crap gone and this stuff put somewhere else, um, I'll be able to actually put the car in the garage and uh, keep it out of the elements. I'm not as worried about it's not, it's not a huge thing. I really just want to get the garage cleaned up and have a proper work area. But having a car like that out there with birds shitting on it and I'm constantly washing it and it gets hand washed, so that's 50, 60 bucks a pop. Um, so, you know, you do that once a week. It adds up. So it would be nice to get it in the garage um, and get it down. Get everything in here manageable and just clean out all the stuff that when you own a house, you're just like, oh, maybe I'll find a use for that. And you throw it off to the side and you never do. 80% <laughs> of that stuff is garbage, needs to go. So uh, have everybody over and we'll everybody just grab something and hold it up and I'll be like, keep or chuck. And that's what's going to happen. So anyway, Nico's going to be over a little later today to collect his new toy. We got a 2022 ZX14R with a more Mafia Flash, BMC race filter, Delcovic exhaust. Um, one down, one up, or one down, two up on the gearing, something like that, with a taller 190-55 profile tire in the back. Um, we got one-inch risers. We got the mounting plate for an OGO Ram mount uh, bag. Things got braided lines up front, Brembo M50 calipers. It's a fantastic bike. I just don't need two. That's really what it comes down to. If I didn't, if you know, if both bikes were paid off and I didn't have any expenses and I didn't want the extra room in the garage, I'd be like, ah, oh, fuck it, I'll just keep it. But I just, eh, for what I'm paying for it um, and not being able to drive it as much as I want. Um, yeah. So anyway, that's what's going on in Dave's garage. That'll be the last time you see that here. You'll still see it in videos because we'll be riding with Nick, uh, Nico, and, uh, you know, it'll still be in the family. So that's good. I'll get to see it once in a while. Maybe he'll let me take it for a spin. But, uh that will be gone soon. So there's your update for today.